Hi everybody, I'm Catherine Elizabeth from Cat Beth Art. Welcome to my art channel and to episode 41. And continuing on with this series where I'm going to be conducting a series of experiments. Today I have the results of the first experiment. So what I wanted to do with this series was to select a palette of colors inspired by the sky and the earth. With the last episode, I trialed the colors in this painting right here. And I quite enjoyed the mixture and the blending of the two colors. So my plan for this painting was to lay the colors down, such as the sky colors were at the top of the painting and that the earth colors were at the bottom of the painting, a sort of landscape, if you will. So let's take it on the studio and see how that turned out. With this painting, I wanted to do a landscape painting. So when I was laying down my colors, I was careful to lay the sky colors toward the top of the painting and the ground colors toward the bottom. Now for the yellow, I decided that I would put that more or less in the middle because yellow could be part of the ground and of the sky. And I lay down my white and my black cell activator give it a chance to work. I'm blowing out the sky portion first, being very careful not to include some of those ground colors in there. And then I began blowing out the ground colors, trying not to incorporate any of the blue in there. Here I am blowing out the sides and I'm noticing that there is a gap between the sky and the ground. No matter how hard I try to blow that out, 
It doesn't seem to be working. So the only thing I can think to do is to try to spread out the paint side to side by giving it a few swirls with my skewer. And I begin my spin, hoping that some of those ground colors will spread out toward the sides. I don't see that happening very well, so I'm trying tilting it. The tilting doesn't seem to be working very well either. And I really don't want to tilt those swirls off because I don't want those heavy lines side to side. So at this point, I'm not really sure what I can do. I'm just gonna see how it dries. I think I've given up on my landscape here and uh, it's gonna be something quite abstract. Stay tuned for the dried result. So, here's the dried result of that painting. I was pleased with the colors of the sky. That part went really well. But when I went to go and blow out the colors of the earth, they just didn't want to spread the way that I wanted them to. And so I took my skewer and I did a little swerving, a little wave movement to try to move that paint around a little bit and gave it a couple of spins to see what would happen. Um, and this is what happened. Not exactly what I was looking for, but I really don't mind it. I'm not mad at it. I think it kind of looks like a twister right here. <laughs> what do you think? I like the blending of the colors right here. I do like the lines. I think that's interesting and maybe that's something that I'll experiment with at another time. I'm not really sure. 
but uh, yeah, that's my first experiment. Um, we'll see what happens next time. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you've enjoyed this episode and I look forward to more in this series of experiments. Hope to see you then. Okay, bye.